Hello friends, welcome to our channel Knowledge Amplifier. So today in my this particular video, I am going to discuss one very interesting application of heat or mist transformation, which is one of the very popular technique to find out a particular pattern present in binary image. And this particular technique is completely based on morphological image processing, which I have already discussed in my previous videos. So the mathematical intuition, MATLAB implementation, concept of don't care in heat or mist transformation is already covered. If you want to know those explanations, please go through the link given in the description box. So today in my this particular video, I am going to show you one particular application of heat or mist transformation. That is field 4 connected heat cells. That is, suppose you are having 4 connection. That is, if you consider this particular small 2D matrix, if you see the central pixel in the north side, in the uh, west side, in the east side and in the south direction, here ones are present. So basically ones are making kind of this connection, right? So this is called four connection pixel, okay, four connected pixels. And if this kind of diamond pattern we are getting, we have to feel that, feel that in the sense, if that central pixel is zero, we have to make that as one. So one means that complete part will become white, right? That is the kind of feeling. So that's what the problem statement is. Feel four connected pixels. Okay. If you consider the northeast direction or northwest direction or southwest direction or southeast direction, here zero can be present or else one also can be present. That does not matter for us. For our purpose, what matters, that is, if this kind of uh, structure we are getting where this is one, this is one, this is one, and this is one, central part is zero, then we have to make the central part as one. Okay, right? Northeast, northwest, southeast, southwest, does not matter for us. Only, we have to consider this particular part. Okay? So, like, for example, if you are given this particular binary image, then where this particular pattern is appearing, if you just uh, try to search, if you see that here this particular pattern is appearing, right? And another location is here. Okay. If you see the northeast, northwest, southeast, southwest, here like all are one, like those pixels, but here this is one, this is zero, this is zero, this is zero. So this does not matter for us. For us, only we have to find out this particular structure and we have to make central pixel as one pixel and that, that, that in that way our this particular problem statement will be solved. Okay. So I hope the problem statement is clear to you. So I will suggest you to pause the video and make an attempt to solve this particular problem. Then you check the solution. That way your thinking skill will be improved in solving image processing problems. Okay. So what we can do? It is quite obvious that the structuring element for foreground is going to be this particular one only. Then the another structuring element what we take in a heat or mist transformation that should be the reverse of the structuring element one. Okay. So if I just draw that structuring element two which is basically representing the background then in that case for this one here zero will come for this one here zero will come for this one here zero will come and for this one here zero will come. And for this zero, here one will come. Okay. In between these pixels, there is no confusion. But confusion comes what to put in these northeast, northwest, southeast, southwest pixels. And as I have told you, that it does not matter for us whether those are one or zero. So we can make them as don't care. So how to make don't care? I have already told you that put the same value. Okay. Like here zero is there. So we can also put zero pixel only in that background structuring element as well. So generally the structuring element 2 should be complement of structuring element 1. But if you see that this particular pixel is 0, here it should be 1 but it is also 0. That means we are trying to say MATLAB that consider this particular pixel as don't care and MATLAB will consider that whether 0 or 1 it will try to fit the particular pattern. Okay. So we got our structuring element 1 and 2. We got our image. Now let's try to apply heat or mist transformation and try to find out these two particular pixels. Okay. So the code will look like this. CLC clear or closer warning off. When I am reading my binary image, our first structuring element as I have shown you 0, 1, 0. First row, second row is 1, 0, 1. Third row is 0, 1, 0. Start considering structuring element 2, which generally we use for background fitting. 
that first row is 0, 0, 0, second row is 0, 0, 1, 0, third row is 0, 0, 0. And then we are applying here heat or mist transformation. Okay. So just, just run this particular piece of code and it is completed. If I show you first our original image BW, this looks like this. And if I show our uh, heat or mist transformed image X, that looks like this. So if you see that this particular pixel is 1, this particular pixel is 1. Actually, wherever the pattern of diamond shape is found, then there at the central part, uh, it just tried to fill with one pixel. Okay. Now, the problem statement is we have to fill four connected pixels. That is, once this is detected, this particular pattern is detected, we have to make them one. So, how to make them one? Very simple. X contains only the detected central part as one, and this is our original image by the way, where the detected central parts are zero. So, we can simply take OR operation. So, BW or with x okay so see the central part is now become one where only those central parts become one where actually the four connection is available okay but we are not at all bothering about the northeast northwest southeast southwest pixels whether that is one or zero it is filling right so this is just another application which i wanted to show you with respect to don't care in heat or mistransformation so that you will be uh, very much familiar with this particular concept if you find this video helpful, then please like, share and comment. Subscribe my channel if you have not subscribed till now. And don't forget to press the bell icon to get the notification of my latest videos. Thank you.